What's up, guys? I wanted to say how excited I am about the 2021 Habit at Time program. I'm really pumped. I know it's going to finally bring the change you've wanted with your health. And I wanted to give you two pieces of advice moving forward to help you really excel with this program. The first thing is words, and the second thing is identity. So words. One word we have to remove from our vocabulary is diet. A diet is just a restriction of certain things for a certain amount of time. So we commit to do the right thing only for a little bit. So from this day forth, let's commit to a lifestyle, one habit at a time. And the problem is with diet is one day we decide to quit everything we do and start doing the right thing, which is drastic and dramatic. And what happens is we attach negative emotions and feelings to the things we're supposed to do. And then we attach positive and kind of heroic feelings to the things we shouldn't do. The unhealthy stuff becomes the hero we miss and crave, and the healthy stuff becomes the bad guy. So through a diet, all we do is form association, and we create the wrong mindset. Why would we only do the right thing for a limited amount of time? Makes no sense. So today, let's commit to a lifestyle one habit at a time. Quick story, when I tore my ACL, I committed to a lifestyle. That's the first thing I did. I said, you know what? I'm going to eat better and take better care of my body. So the first thing I started doing was having a green smoothie. So I first started, I put like a handful of greens and then the next week, two, three. Then I started, I got rid of, you know, the orange juice to start adding water or coconut water, started adding chia seeds. I got better and better. Then after six weeks, it became a part of who I was. I had a green smoothie every day. And the interesting thing is one day I woke up and I no longer wanted fast food. And I love this approach looking back because I never set out on a quest to quit eating fast food or quit this or quit that like a diet tells you to do. I just set out on a quest to have a green smoothie every day. And bad things naturally with less resistance were removed from my life and good things were naturally added. So that's why committing to a lifestyle one habit at a time is crucial and that's what we're doing with this program. So the first thing is let's get rid of the word diet and let's say today I'm going to live a happy, healthy lifestyle and I'm going to do it one habit at a time. The second thing is identity. So quick story, two smokers, both chain smokers, committed to quit smoking. The first smoker went out in the street. A guy offered him a cigarette and he responded and said, I'm trying to quit smoking. The second guy went out on the street and a guy offered him a cigarette. The second guy said, I don't smoke. The difference between the first and second guy is, is the second guy no longer identified himself as a smoker. So starting now, I want you guys to commit and identify yourself as healthy, happy people. We are not eating unhealthy food because we're healthy. No, I don't eat that because I'm healthy, because I'm because I'm living a healthier lifestyle, not because I'm trying to quit it. So today, as we move forward, let's identify ourselves as happy, healthy people. Because the words we decide to say and to think and to identify ourselves really, really matter. If we think we're unhealthy, if we're doing something just for a certain amount of time, because you're trying to be healthy, it's not going to work. So we need to create the right identity to have the right beliefs, because our beliefs control our actions. If we really believe, we'll take more action and it'll be the right energy behind every action. So two things, remember your words, let's get rid of diet, let's commit to a lifestyle and let's identify ourselves as happy, healthy people starting now. Best of luck starting Monday. Let's create a huge community. Let's retweet all this stuff. Let's get as many people signed up as we can. Let's finally make 2020 the year we reach our true potential with health, one habit at a time. Appreciate it, guys. Thank you.